Ink is hit it. So first add one cup of ground onion and saute it. Mmm, this smells really good. Now I've been sauteing this for a few minutes. You see how it's turning a little bit brown? Now add kimchi. That's two cups of kimchi in there. And stir. And this is a perfect meal to take it for lunch. Because it has everything in it and all you have to do is put them in a little portion container. And it's, it's really healthy way to eat. You can also do this with the brown rice too. In here I'm adding one teaspoon of mirin. You don't have to put this in if you don't have it. It tastes fine without it. And I'm also going to add one tablespoon of soy sauce. One teaspoon to one tablespoon of sugar. Those are optional. Okay, now my kimchi is ready to be fried. You may need to... Now if this is not enough rice for you, you could add more. You actually can't go wrong with making this. There's no special guideline as to how much kimchi you put in here. It's your choice. It's your preference. If you like a lot of kimchi in there, put extra. And if you don't like much kimchi, but you like more rice, then put extra rice. There's no right or wrong to cook this. Lower the heat of medium so you don't want the rice to get burned. This will serve four people. Now you can eat this with garnish it with fried egg. It really tastes good with egg too. Mmm, smells nice. Now I'm going to garnish this or add a little bit of sesame seeds. That's about a tablespoon. And actually, don't throw away the sauce. I'm going to add that too. So there will be more kimchi flavor. I'm going to taste and see if it needs anything else. Mmm, really good. I'm going to add some little bit of sesame oil now. You do this, you put about a tablespoon of sesame oil at the end to bring out the flavor. And then I poured in about a tablespoon of sesame oil. Okay, turn off the heat and put it in a bowl. And if you want to add a little bit more sesame seed on top to garnish it, you can do that. But at home, I don't do that too much because it's just us eating. And I already put some sesame seed. But you can garnish it with a little bit of sesame, toasted sesame seeds. And it just looks pretty.